Going for a morning walk in Puerto Galera town. It's eight in the morning. <coughs> it's already hot. Get around this little corner. See how busy the town is, how early. Oh, they got houses for rent right here too. Nice little garden. You can usually get a two bedroom house in this area, 10, 12 thousand. These look pretty nice. Little closed, like a gated community. Let's continue down. Lots of little shops and stuff here. The barber shop. Got a little utility store here. paint store. <laughs> so I'm going to go down to this neat little bar restaurant, resto bar, what they call them here, for breakfast, found the other day, it's got really good food. We some mobile vendors. It's crazy. They'll attach anything to a motorbike. Wow. You know what? You know what time they open? Huh? You know what time they open? What? You know what time this opened? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, they're still closed. Ah, gonna eat breakfast. There he is. Oh, you were very early, huh? Yeah, breakfast. What time are you open? Nine. 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 
Ah, I'm early. Yeah. <laughs> Wait for Ducky. Yeah, yeah. Ah. <coughs> yeah, but come, huh? yeah, I'm vlogging. Vlogging. <laughs> well, if I go down that street, I can get to the water. Yeah. If I go that way? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm going to go get some Move video down there. Yeah. Go okay. to the plaza. Okay. okay. I'll come, come back. back yeah. yeah, I'll come back for breakfast. Yeah. We're going to try to attempt to cross the street. I have no breakfast, only bacon and egg. Huh? I have no um, uh, American big, big breakfast, only ham and, um, bacon, ah, and bacon egg. egg. Yeah, that's, that's okay. That's perfect. Okay. Well, here we go. I'm gonna walk down this way. I've never been this way before. See if we can find a beach. Well, there's some water there. Can, can you walk through here to the beach? Yes. Can I walk that way? It's okay. We'll cut through this little property. It's like a garden. It's like vegetables, I'm not sure which kind. And it's already hot and it's early. Just that quick, I'm out the water. So cool here. Well, this looks like high tide. How was here? The other night, I think night times when low tide comes in. But the low tide went way back there. But it's pretty cool. We got those houses way up there on the hill. We're right here on the beach. I think I'm gonna go this way and see if that might be what those places over there. It might be a restaurant or resort or something. I'm not sure. Let's go check it out. boat round how about that ah you drive your vehicle on this and put it in the water concrete goes all the way down in the water too so I'm gonna walk, try to walk up here on the high side this is like real fine it's not sand it's like rocks the really fine rocks. It's definitely a beach you want to wear shoes in. Uh, get those bigger ones maybe up here. Yeah, my feet are sinking, kind of like sand to just sink about three inches every step. It's like almost like walking in the snow.
Yeah, up there, the mountains here. There's a whole bunch of hidden coves. It's really cool here. You know, you can kind of see around this one. Goes into another cove and another cove. It's kind of messed up, but this is where all the waste and water and gray water. <coughs> Excuse me. From the town, it's just coming out here and going right into the beach. It's messed up. Spilling right in the ocean. Some of the most diverse, or actually the, the most diverse marine life, they say even more in this area in Port Aguilera than even the Great Barrier Reef. And then you have this. There's no telling what's in there spilling into the water into the ocean. Got all these crystal clear, gorgeous beaches. I keep seeing some movement over there. I'm wondering what, there's some, something in that water. Maybe a big fish, could be turtle, could be. We're gonna co record going back the other way. I walked all the way down, most of the way down that cove. Took the wrong shoes for this today. Got a whole bunch of rocks and little shells in my shoes, hurting my feet, so cut it short. Took a shortcut out. I'm gonna head back towards the restaurant for breakfast. So this is kind of what it looks like in a typical street, a main road in the Philippines. Fish market, squid, tilapia, milk fish, squid, fresh caught every morning. Center. The hospital's way at the back, back there. I think that's the city. Not sure what that is. The main part of town. The town center, maybe. Yeah. Not sure what all that is going on over there. Huh? Oh, no, no trike. Just walking. So in the town doing video. What? So what is, is this like the main city hall or city? This one. What is this place? This, this place is terminal. Oh, Jeep terminal. Oh, Jeep. Going to city. Oh, okay, okay. Like a bus terminal, Jeep yeah. terminal, Jeepney. 
Okay. And the hospital is back That's behind. Yeah. Okay. I'm new in the area, so look, looking, yeah, so learning. 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 Yeah, where the restaurant is, where the market is, where the hospital is. There's a market there. The Cadaver. Yeah. There's a new one, I guess, down there. It's gonna Probably open up soon. Talipapa. Talipapa. Retail market. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You have a good day. Everybody's friendly in the Philippines. Everybody has a smile. It's a wonderful country. There's a gas station. Stay. Filling up trikes and motorbikes. Oh, let me get out of the way. Looks like a motorbike sales shop, finance them. For 72 a day, 72 pesos a day. 63 pesos a day, 67, 67, there's a 125, 56 pesos a day. 56 pesos a day right now, I think it's 52.8. Change rate. So, 52 pesos a day, 53 is about a dollar. So you can buy a motorbike for a brand new one, finance it for uh, thirty dollars a month. There's your laundromat, a real laundromat. More motorbikes. Morning. Oh, electronic store. I have to remember that one. I need some plugs and power bar. Oh, here's a big shop. Suzuki. Must be inspection. New bikes. Yes, sir. I just looking around, walking around. Yeah. I saw uh -huh. the video from a vlog. Vlog. So what's uh, what's something like this one? One twenty five. So one twenty five cc. Yes, sir. What are these run new? How much new? Um, 82,410. 82? Those are all, all Honda. All Honda. Honda. It's Yamaha. Okay. Yamaha, okay. And Suzuki. Okay. Cool. Oh. SkyDrive, that's the automatic. Yeah, automatic. 125 SkyDrive. This one is 115. Oh, wow. SkyDrive Sport. The automatic transmission is more expensive? Yeah. Oh. Can a, can a foreigner finance? Finance? Yeah, can a foreigner finance? Yeah. Yeah? Huh? To do finance payments. Um, no, we cash. That's For, foreigners can't finance. Filipinos can finance, but <laughs> foreigners can't. <laughs> what about a permanent resident with ACR card? Uh, it's good. You can you can do finance them. So as long as you're not just tourist, if you're here long term with an ACR card, um, you can probably finance. <laughs> um, not, no, no, not 100% sure. No. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, 
I don't know. Let's go keep walking. Come back. They come back and do a video on that. Full video on uh, the ins and outs of buying a motorbike in the Philippines. That is that is the Barangay Hall. Which brings me back to Oh, I had to watch my head. It's, back to Cheers Bar. Yes, that is the logo. I'm early, they're not open yet. But this is a really cool bar. It's really nice. Lots of lots of shade, lots of fans. We got a pool table. They actually have a pool league here. Every Wednesday, they go here and many other places. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Huh? Look, you can talk, it's okay. Huh? I say you can talk, it's okay. I'm doing yeah. a recording. I make your breakfast. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm here in a minute. I'll All just... Right. I'm gonna put the bar on my video, on my vlog. Yeah, yeah. So they back here, they do karaoke and bands sometimes. Yeah. Cheers, sports bar and resto. They have real cool different neighborhood behind there, but they have an actual real toilet with a lid and I'll do another video explaining what this is if you don't already know I think you kind of don't get the <laughs> get the picture but they call it the bum gun believe me you will learn to improve your aim really quick <laughs> either that or you get your pants wet. I never seen with this on this side. What's this one? Ah, it's like a private. Is that like for a private, uh, if you have a big get big uh, group or party or something? Sometimes. Sometimes? That's what that room is for? Here you can you can get a rum coke for 65 pesos only. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have a seat here in a second and order some bacon and eggs and finish this video. Yep. So here we go. Cheers, bar. Cheers, bar, Porto Galera. Anything. Just kind of hang around a second to see if see anything. It's really cool. You can just kind of explore anywhere and everywhere you want. Ooh, there's another shortcut. Let's see where this comes out real quick. I'll go to the gas station and you can cut through the side here. It's a good thing to remember for the future. sun here is just in the humidity it just if you're in direct just right in the direct sunlight it sucks the energy out you gotta make sure you hydrate like crazy 
lots of water, lots of juices. Maybe the, uh, it's a little difficult to walk to stay near the shoreline, maybe. See my tracks? I'm sinking. At nighttime, when the low tide comes in, <coughs> I see all kinds of people out here with little spear fishing guns and uh, flashlights walking through the water. I asked several locals, what are they looking for? And uh, they tell me some of them are looking for, to get shrimp and crab and different things that they can sell in the market. And some are just out here uh, spearfishing for food for themselves to eat for the day. Wow, see that crab? There's one right there. Well, there he came out. See? They're really quick. Baby crabs everywhere. Real teeny tiny. School of fish right there. What we can see into that water. Oh, I'll see if I can get. Nope. Oh. Ah, shoot, there, got my shoe soaked. Well, that's not gonna be any fun later. That's a long walk down there. I don't think I'm gonna go that far. Yeah, this is a really cool cove, really pretty cove. I think that big yellow house is for rent. It's supposed to be a really big, nice house up on one of these hills available for rent. I'm gonna go try to find it and check it out, maybe do a future video on that. It's supposed to be 4,000 square foot house with a view up on the hill. So I'm gonna walk back, go have some breakfast. I'll add a uh, breakfast video at the Cheers bar to this this one. So, bye for now.